but I went ahead and got it right to 180 on the on the temperature. All right, it's starting to open now just a little bit, and we're right at at 182. So it's opening a little later. You know, it might be my thermometer too. So, but it's right on the money, pretty much close. So now it should be fully. Well, it's not fully yet, but it's opening, so it looks like it's definitely on the money. So that's what you want to make sure is make sure it's working before you put it in. So here on the 3SFE, the RAV4 motor, or it's in some other things, but uh, uh, here's your thermostat housing, this black thing right here, and it's just held on by two 10 millimeter bolts, and just pull that off, and that's where your thermostat goes. Now, uh, on this specific car, to get access to this, I have, I'm doing some other work, but I have the manifold off the, the exhaust, but you can uh, still get to this. Just go ahead and unscrew your, uh, your oil filter right there, and that will help you gain access to here. So then your, uh, your thermostat goes right down in there. I got my new one here, and uh, so this part is the part that's going to be facing out and then remember that this little bleeder air valve is going to be sticking up towards the top so just go ahead and push that in then take your uh, thermostat housing slip it over that Bolt it back down, and that's it. And that's how to uh, install the new thermostat in the 3SFE motor. And it'll be pretty much the same thing on other cars as well. You're just going to want to find that thermostat housing on the motor and access that, and the thermostat will be in there. Just put it back in the same way it was oriented when you took it out. All right, so now go ahead and warm up your car. And make sure that uh, coolant level is rising up to the middle. And make sure it keeps there steady. And, that, and then you'll know your thermostat's good to go. And, uh, you know, there's no fluctuation like up and down in the, in the thermostat gauge. The coolant gauge. Alright, if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching Johnny DIY. Keep on doing it yourself, guys.